So Elizabeth is going to be one of the speakers at our Writing for Your Life Writers Workshop in Holland, Michigan this coming May. Uh, would you like to give us a brief preview of what you're going to be covering? Absolutely. I'm going to be talking about Luther and Kierkegaard a little bit, about how they read. There's, a, there's this terrible story in the Bible, Genesis 22. It's the binding of Isaac. So God approaches Abraham and tells him to sacrifice his son. He says, go up to Mount Moriah and offer your son as a burnt offering to me. And Abraham says, okay, I'll do it. And he goes up the mountain and he's about to sacrifice his own son. And then an angel intervenes at the last minute. The story has a happy ending, but it's a harrowing story. This is a story of faith and horror and obedience and trust and just how awful God can be. And so, so at the conference, I'm going to start out, that's, that story is the hook to, to get us thinking about how, how would, how would we think about writing about that story? What, what sense do we make of it? Martin Luther and Soren Kierkegaard both wrote so powerfully about that story, but in really opposite ways. So I'll show two different models of how they interpret that story in a way that draws their readers into the life of faith. But they did it in very different ways. And there's a diversity of ways to do that with, with anything you're writing about. There's not just one way to write. And then we'll talk a little bit more about the meaning of faith and how our writing can really accomplish that in the engagement between the writer and the community of readers and how that text plays with people and how they play with the text to tell their stories around it and interact with one another and um, the, role of, the role of the spirit in that as well. So that writing really becomes an act of faith and it becomes a, a sort of a, a redemptive, a redemptive act in, in the midst of a world that's really broken. And the, you know, the the conference is called Writing for Your Life. I think that's a great name for a conference. I think what I'll be talking about is writing for our lives. So I want to expand the writing for your life a little bit and say we are all in a community together and the way we write matters. How we write about faith matters particularly. Whether it's writing about scripture or writing about your own story or writing about what you see in the world around you and how we can how we can fix the brokenness or, or writing about joy and the pure beauty of, of it all. But all of those are acts of faith that, that we all engage in together as community. Well, Elizabeth, that sounds very outstanding. I think it's a great topic, and I'm sure there'll be plenty of people interested in hearing you in Michigan in May. So thank you for uh, joining us there. Thank you. So that concludes our interview. Uh, we'll look forward to uh, seeing you again in May. Thank you.